In this tutorial, we're going to walk through the process of uploading a document. Uh, we'll be starting with a Word doc, just because that's a very common format. What you're going to do is start by clicking the New button on that sidebar, and you're looking for File Upload. That will open up a window for you that will let you navigate through different folders on your computer and find the document you're looking for. And you just select it and click Open. At the bottom of the screen, it's going to give you the, the progress of how your document is doing. So it's now uploaded, and it tells us that we're completed with our upload. So I can click these little notifications out of the way. And you'll see our document shows up in our drive right here. That is the default place for it to go. And you can tell that it's a Word document because we have our little blue W here in the corner. If I double click that file, it's going to give me a preview only version of that document. I can scroll through it, I can see everything that there is, I can even click hyperlinks, but I cannot edit it right now. If I do want to edit it, I have to click on this open with Google Docs. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. And you'll see that it opened up a new tab here. And what it's doing right now is converting that Microsoft Word document into a Google Doc. So now that I've done that, I can actually go through and I can make changes to it. And I can move my pictures around or add new pictures. I'm going to close this document just by closing the tab. And you'll see I still have that original Word document open here. To get back to my drive, I'm going to click on this X in the top right corner. And you'll notice that I have two identical documents now. One of them is a Word document. One of them is a Google document. That will happen if you upload a Word document and then convert it into a Google Doc. If I make changes to one, it will not appear on the other. These are totally separate documents. If you do not want to end up with two copies of the same document, there is a way to work around that. So I'm going to show you that right now. I'm going to get rid of these by right-clicking them and removing. And before I do any uploading, I'm going to go to the settings, which is in the top right corner. It looks like a gear. And I'm looking for settings. The second line down, convert uploads, you want to make sure you check this box that says convert uploaded files to Google Docs editor format. So you make sure that's checked and you click done. And then you're going to go through the same process again. We'll click new. We'll do File Upload, and I'm going to use the same document, only this time it's not going to upload it to a Word document, it's going to convert it directly into a Google Doc. So I'll only end up with one copy that I can edit right away.